today I'm going to be opening up a $5,000 Pokemon cards time capsule. And the crazy thing is we're going to be going all the way back to the year 1995. Each mystery box marks a five year span in Pokemon card history. We'll be starting off at the most current generation and work our way all the way back until we get to the oldest Pokemon cards. And huge shout out to TJ who's a subscriber of the channel that I actually purchased these boxes from. He also included a package for you guys. I actually have no idea what's inside of this, but make sure you enter the giveaway by number one, smashing the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, down below in the comment section, let me know what your favorite year of Pokemon cards was. So we're going to start off with box number one. And as you guys can see on the bottom here, it says 2018 to 2022. So this is going to be Sword and Shield era. And then check it out. We also have Sun and Moon. All right, let's see what we got in our first box. Oh, here we go. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of stuff here. So we got a note. Let's start with this. Welcome to modern day Pokemon. Back in 2018, the Pokemon TCG started the year with a bang with the introduction of Prism cards in Sun and Moon Ultra Prism. The hype was moderate at best, but as time went on, we were blessed with the introduction of the Poke Cave, open world uh, Pokemon gameplay in the new Pokemon Sword Shield expansion and the great Pokemon boom of 2020 led by Logan Paul and some random bald dude who thought a base at Bulbasaur was 30k. Sleeves were empty, scalpers were everywhere, and the Pokemon community was in a panic. Luckily for the community, the storm seems up past, and the shelves are now starting to replenish with one of the best eras in the franchise that has ever produced. I present to you Pokemon from 2018 to 2022. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. Let's start off with our first item here. And also, I think TJ said his wife, like, actually did the artwork on the boxes, so shout out to TJ's wife as well. The boxes look absolutely insane. But this says open first, so let's see what we got here. I think they're all individually wrapped. Oh my god, is that just a giant pile of cards? Okay, let's see what we got. This is gonna be crazy. Um, I just... <laughs> TJ emailed me, he was like, Yo, you wanna do a, this crazy mystery box idea I had? I was like, let's do it. Alright, so let's start off with these cards that are just in regular penny sleeves. We got the Grand Bull V, Blaziken V, we got a Venusaur V. Oh, we're going through all the V cards right now. Gardevoir, Eternatus, Lucario. We got Celebi, that's, one, that's a really nice one. Steelix. Crabominal. Here we go. We're moving into celebration. We got Flying Pikachu. We got the base set Pikachu with Salamence. Super Boost Energy. That's a Prism card right there. Togekiss V. Slowking V. Stoutland. We got Torkoal. Scent of Scorch. And an Ice Rider Calyrex. Start off the top loaders. We got a Charizard. Moving into the Flareon Trainer Gallery. So we're getting a nice little history lesson here. Oh, we got a, we got a rainbow. Okay. Rainbow Trainer. Machamp V Max. Nice. Okay. I actually don't have that card. That's sick. Uh, Decidueye V Star now. Moving through Mimikyu Trainer Gallery. Got a regular Vaporeon Hollow. Pikachu, nice 25th anniversary. Got a nice Leafeon Hollow Black Star promo. Some more. Uh, we got Eevee. Flappy Gold Card. Gym Trainer Full Art. Yo, when does it stop? This is madness. Tox this is the first item in this box, guys. I have five boxes. <laughs> Rocky Amazing Rare. Um, we got more trainer gallery action. Lou Minion! Flapple. Dark Arados celebrations. Octillery. This is already madness. Pierce. Big Parasol. Gardevoir V Full Art. Oh, the Rapidash V Full Art. Alchemy V Max. Remember that one? Volcania. Yeah, this, this is sick. This is a perfect time because we're coming to the end of the Sword and Shield era. Guzzlord and Aralt Shiny. That was, that was just the first item. Moving on! The second item. Let's see what's in here. Oh, I hope you guys have your popcorn because this is kind of already going to be insane. And remember, I'm going to open that giveaway uh, item as well a little bit later. I literally have no idea what could possibly be in there. So let's go. Next item is a... Oh, okay. We actually have a theme deck. for. That's a Forbidden Light. That's actually kind of hard to find these. Uh, Forbidden Light theme deck. Nice. I'm trying to decide which things I want to keep sealed and which things I want to open. I I'm going to open a lot. I might just keep this one sealed. I think this one's kind of worth just keeping sealed. So I'll put this one to the side. All right, this one says open third. Okay, open third. We might have some jumbo cards. Ooh, what's this? Okay. Oh, there's more in here. There's more in here. Ooh, start off with the GX. Black Star promo SM197 Greninja. We got the Charizard GX, a classic. Nice. Double V. I remember these. I remember these. Yep. I remember these too. This is Champion's Path. Urshavu V. We got, oh, this is actually a really good idea, by the way, for uh, to protect these. I never would have thought of using these, like, binder things. Urshavu V, single strike. We got the Charizard V-Star from Brilliant Stars. And then we, oh, Reshiram and Charizard. That's huge. That's huge. Wow, that is insane. Still a bunch in the first box. This one's open fourth. 
Like, it's just basically going to get crazier and crazier as we go through these time capsule boxes. All right, TJ, what do we got in this one? We have... Oh, nice. Okay, so we have some blisters and Detective Pikachu. All right, so first item, Detective Pikachu booster pack. Second item is a two-pack blister with Battle Styles and Darkness Ablaze. I feel like I don't really remember this product. Let me know if you guys do down below in the comment section. Ah, what the heck? Let's crack this one open while we have it. So I'll grab the Battle Styles out and then the Darkness Ablaze. Like, I kind of have to pick and choose on some of these things what to open and what to keep sealed because... I definitely don't think we're going to have enough time to open every single item in here. But it's fine because some of these items I will be able to open up in other videos. So you will eventually see everything get opened up here. All right. So our first pack of the day is Zubat. Oh, first pack of the day. Single strike style mustard with the rainbow. Okay, now I'm glad I opened that up. <laughs> and the three promo cards are in there too, which is cool. You know what? I'm actually going to go straight through this one. Let's continue our luck. Paris Marie Ducklet. Clink, Grimer. Oh, Charizard V. Charizard V. Yo, that was a blister. <laughs> no way. Something was telling me to open that up. All right, let's keep going. Here we go. Open fifth. I think we're almost through the first generation or the first five years. Basically, that's how it works. They're in five-year increments. I think the last one, though, was like seven years or eight years. Ooh, okay. I think we got more cards. These ones might be a little fancier because they're in card savers. A little fancy smancy. Oh, yeah. Starting off with the full art Charizard V. Moving into an Umbreon. That's a beautiful artwork. Arceus V. Black Star promo. That's one of the best. Mewtwo. Uh, wait, it's in a... Wait, what is... Oh, oh, Brilliant Stars. Wait, what? Promo card Mewtwo. Wait, what is this from? And it's a reverse with the Brilliant Stars stamp. I actually have no idea where you got this from. Somebody let me know in the comments. The Break Dancing Genesect alternate artwork. Rillaboom Gold? Yeah, these... Oh! Oh, Gengar BBQ GX. Yep. These are the big hitters. Snorlax VMAX. Professor's Research Rainbow. Another... Yo, we're stacking up the Charizard Vs today. Snorlax Full Art. Oh, Umbreon Gold Star. Dude, this is nuts. And a Charizard VMAX. Oh, wait. Is there one more? The Charizard VMAX Rainbow. Dude, you did not just put that in there. Oh, my God. That is nuts. What? What else could possibly be in this box? That was the craziest one so far, definitely. All right, I think this might be a booster box, but which booster box is it going to be is the question. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, we got some more padding on here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, actually, I don't. I still don't know. Forbidden? No. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to think. Forbidden Light, maybe? Burning Shadows? Ultra Prism. Yo, that's solid. Ultra Prism. Ooh, that's a really good one. Yo, let's go. Yeah, this one we're definitely not going to have time to open up today, but this will definitely be featured in another video for sure. We still got to pull the ultimate for our trainer uh, Pokemon card, and it's in this box. The last item for our first time capsule box right here. Okay, are we saving something crazy for last? Are we saving something crazy for last? TJ, what's it going to be? Okay. Oh, no. Are these great at cards? Bro, they're great at cards. They're great at cards. They're great at cards. Oh, yeah. Dude, can we just say, like, shout out to TJ for the... This is crazy. Like, the, the we have such a variety of different, like, types of products here. Oh! Oh, this is crazy already. Dragon Majesty? I've never pulled that. I've never held this card. Ultra Necrozma GX Gold Secret Rare in a PSA 10. Oh, my God. Yo, dude, what is happening right now? Black Star promo tag team card in a 10, bro. Stop. Whoo. Whoo, shiny ho -Oh. Japanese sun and moon gem in 10. Dude, your collection is insane right now. Dragon Majesty Charizard PSA 10. Ooh, the shiny Charmeleon as well. Man, the shinies look really nice, uh, Japanese version. Are you kidding me? A pre-release Charizard? Mid-nine? I've never even seen this card. I've never even seen this card in person. What is this? Groudon Legendary Pokemon Stamps? 
Dude, I actually have to look this card up real quick. I have, I have no idea where this is from, but look at that stamp. Okay, I looked it up. This is actually a GameStop promo card um, that the, you had to get, I guess, at GameStop. It's pretty sick. So we made it to box number two, 2013 to 2017. So we have X and Y, and then we still have some Sun and Moon as well. All right, let's see what we got. Welcome to the era Pokemon that nobody could have pictured being referred to as vintage, and yet here we are. It's currently 2013, and Pokemon is a little more than halfway through the black and white era. Pokemon Black 2 and White 2 have been in everyone's Nintendo DS for about six months, and Plasma Storm just dropped into Pokemon TCG. As time would roll on, we would say goodbye to the black and white era and in the introduction of X and Y in October 2013. X and Y delivered some amazing sets and Steam Siege. Luckily for Steam Siege, it was overshadowed by the release of Pokemon Go in July 2016. This release took the world by storm and brought the entire planet together, sprinting through Do Not Trespass signs to get Wild Dragonite. What followed the release of Pokemon Go was seemingly nonstop bangers, a base set reprint of Evolutions and the release of the first few sets in the Sun and Moon generation. In celebration of Pokemon Go bringing the world together, let's start this opening with Kaja Snorlax. I present to you Pokemon from 2013 to 2017. Ooh, I've never seen this box before. Dang, that's sick! One, two, three, four evolutions, a bunch of Snorlax promos. Oh, is this the first release? I guess a Spanish box? I have no idea, but this looks amazing. <laughs> All right, we'll put this to the side for another video. All right, here's a second item. Man, there's just so much stuff. You know it's a good mystery box when there's just things that you've never even heard of or seen before. And then we've seen a bunch of those. And what is this? This might be another one. Oh, dude, this is a happy... Oh, okay, I remember these. Oh, dude, this is so cool! Okay, yeah, I forgot. So we're probably going to be seeing a bunch of things that aren't just TCG-related as well, which is awesome. There are. This did come with a card. Um, but yeah, these, like, shoot out or whatever. That's cool. All right, open third. Let's see what we got here. This might be another thing of, like, loose car... Oh, my God, it is. Dude, there's so many. There's so many! Woo! Okay, okay, okay. What? Oh, my God. This is nuts. Kingdra, Excadrill. Dude, I can't even barely hold all of these. I'm just going to go through these so you guys can enjoy the artworks. Swello. Oop, we lost the Rhyperior. Togekiss. Bro, what is happening? Golem Butter. Oh my god, Butterfree. Dragonite, Trampa. Oh, I'm, I'm trying not to miss these. Tyranitar, Feraligator. Oh my god. Dude, Team Plasma. We got Latios, Sceptile, Pyroar, Hiram. Porygon Z? Oh my god. Oh my god. There's so many amazing... There's so many amazing cards in here. <laughs> Gardevoir, Stunkfist, Purloin, Sinchino, Theoxys. This is amazing. Venusaur EX. Now we're moving... Okay, we're moving into EXs. Break. Break hearts. Surfing Pikachu. We got a Pidgeot. We got the Flying Pikachu. Evolution stuff. More evolutions. Oh... Team Plasma versus Team Aqua. Clefairy, we got Hitmonchan, Chansey, Ninetales, Zapdos. We got a Polyrath. Ooh, Jirachi. Wow. And then these were the ones behind it in the top loaders. You got a Meloetta EX from the Radiant Collection. Oh, Mewtwo EX. Life Dew. Oh my god, we got Ace Back Trainer cards. You have Veltal EX. Kiram EX. Dude. Dude, I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless. <laughs> oh my god. Mars Shadow Celebi. That's insane. Black Star Promo. Oh, those are from the Generations uh, boxes, I think. Pikachu. We got more Celebi action. Pikachu. Mega Rayquaza EX. Oh, Misty's Full Art uh, from Evolutions. And then a Shining Arceus from Shining Legends. This is this is truly a time capsule of boxes, guys. This is insane. Whoops, this said open first. We're gonna open it now. Okay, open first. I didn't open first. Oh, I know what this is. This is a play mat from Shining Legends. Uh, Ultra Premium Collection boxes. These are really cool. All right, I have opened this before and it looks so good. This one and the Hidden Fates play mats are some of my favorites. Just look how amazing that is. Just Shining Pokemon. On a play mat. Think we're on this one. Open fourth. Okay, I think we're gonna have. Okay, more jump. Oh man, this, this just keeps this keeps getting rarer and older. The stuff that we open. Raichu GX, bro, I love these. There's so many cool ones. Oh my god, there's so many crocodile. Dude, this is beyond crazy. This is beyond crazy. Mewtwo EX, Charizard GX, 
Normally, I'd be stopping on all these cards for so much longer, but there's just so much craziness. Mega Lucario EX, Primal Kyogre EX, and a Deoxys EX. Dude, this is nuts. I think we're honestly moving into best mystery box ever category right now. Like, I think this might actually be it. I think this is it. I honestly think this is it. We're not even halfway done yet. Open fifth. All right, let's see. Oh, 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 oh. Booster packs, baby. Phantom Forces. Ooh, ooh, XY base. Oh, uh, and then nice, a Breakpoint Blister with, oh my God, that's one of the coolest promo cards. And I've never even seen it. Actually, man, this this is a really nice blister. Wow. All right, um, we got, I, I feel like I gotta open these. I feel like I gotta open these. So let, let's open these two booster packs up. XY base. I'm still on the hunt for the first ever full art uh, cards of, of EX cards of Blastoise and Venusaur that you can pull out of here. 2014. So the first ever X and Y sets ever released. I think we got to open it. I think we got to open it. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Um, code card and then three for the back. <sighs> okay. Yeah, these are the first ever. And that's the first ever silver card in there too. All right. Scatterbug, Weedle. We got Rhyhorn, Bidoof, Spoink. Ooh, Conkeldor, non-hollow. I, re I can't resist these two packs. I can't resist. Phantom Forces, still on the hunt for that silver card. Okay, code card. And then we're just gonna do three. Are we ready, are we ready? All right, hand scope. Target Whistle, Purloin, Chansey. Oh, Venomoth, non-hollow. Almost there, we got open sixth. I believe this is the second to last item in this box, and then we're gonna be going back in time even further. Okay, oh, okay, I'm starting to get the rhythm of these boxes right now. Man, just one of the best presentations of mystery boxes and ideas I feel like ever. Uh, okay, oh, 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 oh my God, here we go, here we go. Switch gold card. Woo, secret rare. Shining Jirachi. Shining Legends, Mega Charizard EX, Evolutions, Mega Blastoise EX, Full Art from Evolutions, Shining Volcanion, Ooh, an Entei GX, Rainbow from Shining Legends, man, nice. Final item in our second time capsule, open last, well, like that, okay, open last, um, Cool. Feels like PSA cards. It's PSA cards. It's PSA cards. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Ooh! <laughs> oh my god! Crimson Invasion Garrett. Like, these are cards that I've never even pulled before. Rainbow in a Gem Mint 10. Stop it. Oh my god. Shining Legends Secret Rare Mewtube. PSA 9. Plasma Blast. Shiny Execute. See, bro, I've never even held half of these cards before. In a 9. Evolution Charizard Hollow 9. Shining Mew, Shining Legends 9. This is crazy. This is crazy. Mega Rayquaza EX Full Art. Ancient Origins, PSA 9. Shining ho -Wo. Elite Trainer Box, Shining Legends, Gem Mint 10. <laughs> oh my god. The Gold Reshiram Full Art from Legendary Treasures in a PSA 8. This is insane. I literally had to double check. That's the second box only of the five. We're officially at box number three, which goes back 2008 to 2012. And if you look on this one side, there is Pokemon Diamond and Pearl in here. All right, let's get it going. Oh man, okay, let's go. No, honestly, I, th I think this I think this is gonna be it. I think this is gonna be the best mystery boxes we've ever opened up on the channel. Welcome to what I like to refer to as the forgotten era of Pokemon. The year's 2008 and we are deep into the Pokemon. The year's 2008 and we are deep into the Diamond and Pearl generation of Pokemon. Great Encounters just released in the Pokemon TCG and Pokemon Ranger Shadows of Alamia just released on the Nintendo DS. Later this year, we would be introduced to Giratina as the Pokemon Platinum game released in September. 
As time would pass, we would be reintroduced to the Johto region in Pokemon Heart Soul Silver the following year. These games brought with them the most electrifying TCG sets like Triumphant, Undaunted Supreme Victors, and Call of Legends, leading to the introduction of Pokemon Black and White in 2011. Meanwhile, during this amazing time period, a lot of us 90s kids tried to convince ourselves we've grown out of Pokemon and stopped collecting, leading to the low pop reports and strong desire to recapture these cards in later years. What a mistake that was for most of us. Now it's 2012 and Pokemon just released Boundaries Cross for TCG and Pokemon Black and White 2 on Nintendo DS. I hope the future Pokemon gets more creative than <laughs> Garbodor, King Link, and Vanellux. I present to you Pokemon from 2008 to 2012. I like the commentary on these boxes. All right, it's about to, I, I, it's already been crazy, but it's about to get really, really even crazier, I feel like. All right, open first. Let's see. Oh, my God. There's already... What is this? Oh, oh, that looks cool. Oh, it is cool. Oh, it's black and white emerging powers theme deck. Dang. That looks cool. E even older theme decks are pretty nice. Ooh, we're going to open this second. What is this? It feels like it's something that's framed. Oh, my God. What? No. Dude, I love this kind of stuff. Diamond and Pearl, Sinnoh region play. Bro, that kid is having the best time of all time. This is so sick. Can we just take a second to appreciate some old school advertising here? Like, that looks just, that just looks so amazing. I, I never had that as a kid, but uh, it looks pretty sweet. Open third. Okay, this one seems like it's fragile. So I gotta be careful opening this up. I don't wanna ruin anything, but it's super thin. Oh, wait, is it a jumbo card in there? What the heck is this? Dude, you guys, it's like 3D, like the background. Oh my God, what? I've never seen this. Bro, you were you were such a crazy collection of cards and stuff that I've never seen before. Dude, I don't know if you guys can tell from the camera, but it makes it like, like the text is and everything, even the artwork is just popping off of the card. I feel like my, my collection of jumbo cards right now has just like 10 x I forget where you are. I think this is open. I think we're on fourth, maybe. Yeah, I think that's right. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Like we we are just. I don't know. Like we are going way back now. So anything that we open up could just be insane at this point. What is this? Oh my god! <laughs> I just pulled out old school booster packs. Hold on. The sampling pack, black and white. I think that's base. Is that for base? Wait, no. There's is there two? There's two sampling. Packs. Oh, Boundaries Cross sampling pack as well? That's amazing. These are pretty cool to keep sealed, honestly. So I'm going to keep these sealed. Oh my god, I've never seen this one. Squirtle on there? I honestly can't handle this mystery box right now. Oh, Dark Explorers! Dark Explorers! Alright, I got to stop opening all the stuff up. I want to open this, but I, I think we're going to have a follow-up video to this because there's just too much cool stuff. I think we're going to have to have a follow-up video where we open up a bunch of it. Okay, open fifth. Open, oh my god, okay. Is this, is this gonna be another? Oh no, oh my god, there's so many cards. Like, how can you put that many cards in here if we're at one of the oldest eras already? With still two more boxes, two more time capsules left. Oh my god, okay, here we go. Tornadus Hollow, Slacking Hollow, Latios. It doesn't stop. I mean, this is all black and white, but are we gonna go back even further? Crobat, Moltres, there's so many. Giratina? Oh, dude, we are literally, we're, we're, we're in Diamond and Pearl, right? I don't even know where we are. I don't even know where we are anymore. Victory Bell. No, that's, that's Heart Gold, Soul Silver. Oh my God. Mamo Swine. Can you guys even see this? Giratina? Dude, this is nuts. This isn't normal. This isn't normal. Cobalion. Oh, we're in Platinum Era now. I don't even know where we are. We're, I, I, I'm lost. I'm lost in the nostalgia. I, I'm, I'm lost in time right now. That's stamped. Mewtwo EX. Blackstar promo. Oh my god. Black and white era stuff. Rayquaza EX. Zorar. More Zorar. Keldeo. Samura. Oh. And a Lapras. Blackstar promo. How is there still more? Oh my god. I'm actually speechless. There's two more time capsule boxes left as well. I just, I don't know. I don't know. Like, this is it. I think we made it. I think we made it to the best mystery box we've ever had. I, I don't, I don't think, I think this is it. I think we peaked, guys. I think it's time. I think, I think that's it. Like, I don't know where you can go from here. I don't know. I honestly don't know where you can go from here on a mystery box.
No. Oh my god. Oh my god, it is not! Dude, I am hyped for this. Pokemon Black version 2. No way. Oh. Oh. Is it gonna is the game? The game's in here. Oh, and the manual. And all the inserts. Bro, stop it. This is insane. Oh, what? I'm actually gonna have to play this. I'm, I'm gonna have to play this tonight now. I have to play. What else? What other inserts came with this? Okay. Yep. Oh, the Nintendo Wi-Fi connection info. Here you go. Club Nintendo. I don't think you can use that anymore. I don't even think there's Club Nintendo. I think they they ended that. But there you go. If you if you can use that, use it. I, I don't think so though. Um. Oh. Man. Wow. Dude. I never. I've never gotten a video game in a mystery box before. This is insane. And here we go. Open last. Okay, this is the last item before we get to the second to last mystery box time capsule. Okay, open last. I'm opening it last. I'm opening it last. I'm opening it last. I'm opening it last. Oh no, is it is it graded cards? Is it graded cards? Like what? What? What could what could this possibly be? What could this possibly be? Oh my god! Oh my god! Yo, I can't do this anymore. This is too much. Rayquaza Shiny from Dragon's Exalted. Bro, like, I've never even held this card before. There's so many cards and items I've never even held before from this mystery box. PSA 8, still insane, because it's, it's... How? How, bro? I am done. I'm literally done. I'm done. I'm done. I can't do this. Charizard Level X? It did not, bro. What? Let me just say this really quick because I didn't, I never, I, I didn't know TJ was. TJ, you know, TJ sent me an email and he, he had this idea and it was all just like, it's like, yeah, you, like, it's, it's, it's gonna be something where you know, like, you don't know me, but I can promise you, you won't regret this. And I was like, there's something about, there's something about you, like, I, like. Normally, I'm just like, nah, like, you know, I, I don't know about that. But I was, uh, like, there's something about you that like, I just feel like I can trust you. And this turned into probably the best mystery box we ever had. And we're not even, we're probably like about halfway done now. Okay. Oh my god! It's a shiny Gyarados! It's literally a shiny Gyarados! From Heart Gold Soul Silver Base, bro! Bro! I've never held any of those. I mean, I have, I've, I have pulled one of this, but I've never, I've never, definitely never pulled that. I've never pulled that. Never even held it before. Keldeo EX, Boundaries Cross Full Art. Oh, Rayquaza, Supreme Victors. And it's Swablu Shiny from Platinum. Oh my God. Bro, that, there's more Shinies graded in there than non-Shinies. That has some that 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 is crazy. All right, this is gonna be insane. Box number four right here, 2003 to 2007. We're gonna have the E series. We're gonna have some diamond and pearl. We might even go gold star hunting with the EX era as well. But here we go, the second to last box. Moment of truth. Oh man. Okay, okay. Let's start with the note. Welcome to the end of an era in Pokemon and new beginnings. The year is 2003, and Wizard of the Coast has just released its final two sets in the Pokemon TCG with Aquapolis and Skyridge. Two of the least printed and most overlooked sets ever at the time of their release. The new car smell on Pokemon has worn off and the hype has died down from a few years prior. Yeah, that's pretty true. Pokemon Coliseum is set to come out in the GameCube in a few months. I remember that one. Giving people something to look forward to after the release of Ruby and Sapphire for the Game Boy Advance the year prior. Nintendo would give the Pokemon CD rights to the Pokemon Company, thus ending the Wizard of the Coast era with the release of EX Ruby and Sapphire in June of 2003. The EX series had begun. And over time, we would be introduced to the Gold Star Pokemon cards and overpowered EX cards and some of the greatest sets ever released. As time passed, Nintendo would release the Nintendo DS in 2004 and the Nintendo Wii in 2006. Man, that was a while ago. This brought a great expansion of Pokemon games, including Battle Revolution in 2006, which introduced us to the new era in Pokemon, the fourth gen Diamond and Pearl, with many Gen 1 Pokemon getting uh, much needed evolutions and the introduction of level X Pokemon in the Diamond and Pearl sets. Pokemon seems to be in good hands as we close out 2007. I present to you Pokemon from 2003 to 2007. Got it. That box, it was stuff. I feel like there's more stuff in that box than the other ones. Okay. Are we ready? 
Anything from EX era, Diamond and Pearl, and E series. Oh, oh my God. Yo, the figures. Okay. This is, is this going to be a whole checklist? Bro. Oh my God, it is. Let me move my face out of the way so you can see this. Dude, let's go. That is so sick. That is so sick. What else is in here? Oh, more goodies. More goodies. Okay, is this going to be, oh, here's the, here's like the play mat to actually play the game. I have some of those figures somewhere in my collection. Actually, I know where they are. Oh, next quest. Okay, so we got the rule book to go with it. What else we got in here? Some more. Okay, so maybe another play mat. Dude, okay, another mat. Yes. Oh, oh, it's a diamond and pearl uh, play mat. And what else? What else? There's a couple more. Actually, there's a bunch more. We got Majestic Dawn card list. Oh, my God. That's sick. We got Dragon Dragon Frontiers. Dragon Front. Bro, look at that. Right there. Gold Star Charizard. Gold Star Charizard. And then we get another play mat. Okay, this one's... The, I don't know what... I can't even guess what could possibly be in here. This is the open second one. That was taken up, like, a lot of the box. What is in here? What is in... Dude! It's an OG Pikachu plot! Oh my god! Look at this, dude! Does it... Does he do anything? It feels like he does something. There's, it feels like there's something in there. Okay, turn my battery pack switch to on. On. And yeah, did you guys see that? It says 2004 on the back. We ready? What's he gonna do? Can you guys hear that? We got the mic, Pikachu. Oh, the cheeks light up. I didn't even realize. Dude, this is as OG of a Pikachu I feel like I've ever held. That's crazy. All right, open third. That, that Pikachu, I'm actually surprised that was from 2004. Oh my God, he's still talking down there. He's screaming. Is he like a Furby? He's not, he's just gonna like talk like randomly at the middle of the night. Okay, I swear he was still talking. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Wait a second. Nobody likes bulk until it's vintage. Oh my god. No. Whew. 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 Mudkip E series all oh here we go. That is correct. I, I agree with you on that one. Oh my god. Yes. So we just have some old school old school bulk, which something about the old school makes it that much better. Every card just you guys hear that? Pikachu's actually he's still talking back there. Okay, that's kind of creepy now. Sharpedo, Kabuto. No wonder he turned it off. I think it just talks randomly. Poochiana, Hello, Nose Pass. Meryl, we got Shroomish. We are just going through the E series, not two. Torchic, Root Fossil, Traco. Oh my god. Are we in the. What's. Where are we in Pokemon history right now? The e, it's got to be all E series, right? All E series. Oh my god, this is crazy. This is it guys. We, we got the craziest mystery box today. This is it. Okay, he definitely doesn't turn, he doesn't stop talking. I'm gonna turn him off. Found it, open fourth. There's there's so many in that one. I, I think that has the most. All right, what do we have? What do we have? <gasps> mystery dungeon, red rescue. Oh my god, we got the, <laughs> we got a Game Boy Advance game too. Dude, let's go. Yo, okay, okay, we got some gaming to do. We definitely got some gaming to do. Okay, Pikachu's still talking over there. Maybe I didn't actually turn him off when I thought I did, or he's just not gonna stop. Okay, open fifth. All right, all right, are we gonna have some advertising maybe? Let's do the reveal. Oh! Be the star attraction. Dude, we got a Pokemon National Championships um, advertisement. Behold the power of Machamp. Dude. This is sick. And I love that he sent them out framed and everything. Oh my god. Okay, we got to put some of this stuff up, I feel like. Moving on to this. Open sixth. Okay, I feel like this might be a card, so I got to be careful. I think we got a note. Okay, what's the note say? Limited edition promotional bookmark. Pokemon Diamond and Pearl with Chimchar on it. Whoa, okay, so we got only for Nintendo DS 2007. The next generation of Pokemon is here. Like, I wonder how you got this bookmark. Like, what was the deal? That's sick. Actually, I completely forgot the giveaway item. Um, I've had it to the side. I would have showed you guys this much earlier, but let's just reveal it now. So this was the giveaway item that TJ um, threw in 
again, I have no idea. I don't know what's in. I literally have no idea what any of this stuff was going to be. Um, so I don't know what this is. Oh, it's PSA cards. Oh, oh, oh my god. Okay, okay. Let's see what we got. Oh, oh, it looks like there's two. Okay, first one. Oh, Garchomp PSA 10 shiny from Hidden Fates. Okay, so we'll do that as like one number, the first winner. And the second winner. Oh, there we go. Decidueye Gem Mint 10 shiny as well. Okay, those are getting thrown in as the giveaway. Item number seven. All right, these are the final three items in the second to last mystery box. It's gonna be crazy. And then we're gonna get onto the last one. And I think the last one was like eight different generations or eight years of, of Pokemon history. Oh, no, Deoxys Pop Series card, I believe. No, is that a pop? I don't know what's what is this from. No, no, no. This is this is a Diamond and Pearl era, I think. Oh my God, Manfi, we got Jumpluff, dude. Delta Species, Flygon. Okay, we gotta go through these a little slower. Shraptor, Ludicolo, Shiftry, Bastiodon. So we're going, we're literally going through like three different eras right now. Napoleon, Magmortar, we got Rhyperior, Traco, E Series, Black Star. Oh, that's a cool one. Chimchar, Diamond and Pearl, Turtwig. Oh my god, okay, wait. Oh, we're at, oh, 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 Empoleon Level X. Oh, that's from the tin. I literally... Oh, wait. That video might not be out yet. Okay. Yeah, I'll save that. But yeah, I literally just... I, I have this card. <laughs> uh, Lucario. What is this from? Dude, I, didn't, I don't even know what that's from. It, should, it has a little Lucario on the bottom there. All right, this is open eighth. We might have some more promotional advertising, which is always sick. Okay. Here we go. The big reveal. It's nice and framed up like the other two. Oh! Poke Center! Wait, is this like an official Poke Center? This month, Kanto's Pokemon are taking the TCG by storm, and with one of the Pokemon Coliseum teams provide a simple strategy is often best. We got the theme decks from the Fire Red and Leaf Green. Um, we got some more Fire Red Leaf Green cards. Dude, of course, the three EXs that you could pull. Oh, man. All right, I'm, I'm kind of scared. This is the last item. This is it before we get back to the original era. This is graded. This is graded. Are they all PSA graded? Pop 11. Pop 11. On that last card. Okay. So there's only 11 of these. That's an old label. That's an old PSA label too. Okay. Oh my God. We just got a gold star. We just got a gold star. PSA 9 Entei gold star from Unseen Forces. Bro, what is happening? Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. This is nuts. A Nido King crystal from Aquapolis. PSA 8. No. Bro, stop. Pers Rockets Persian EX from Team Rocket Return. No, from Unseen Forces. Unseen Forces. <laughs> Pikachu or Bla Pikachu Black Star promo. Pikachu Black Star promo. PSA nine. <laughs> Scyther EX Ruby Sapphire. I think this this is how do you how do you have a mystery box that has a gold star, a crystal, the boot tops EX from Sandstorm. PSA 9. Bro. And then an EX Dragon Frontiers Gem Mint 10. Mantine. And it's a Pop 11. And this is the old case. This is the old. I remember grading with PSA with the old cases. There's only 11 of these. That, it, that is the craziest lineup of graded cards. Oh my god. Like a gold star and a crystal. A gold star and a crystal. My mind still isn't is not comprehending this. We're at the final box. This is 1995 to 2002, and it's literally a Pokeball. Or a Poke Square. Or rectangle. Check it out. Wizards of the Coast on the bottom. It's going to be nuts. The moment of truth. Okay, here we go. It begins. 
Welcome to where it all began, the Wizard of the Coast era. It's early on a Saturday morning in 1998, and you sprint downstairs to turn on Kids Warner Brothers to watch Ash run to Professor Oak to get his starter Pokemon, only to find he was beaten there by Gary Oak and ended up with Pikachu with an attitude problem. You're hooked, the rest is history. You save up your allowance to buy a Game Boy Color to get your copy of Pokemon Red, Blue, or Yellow. The store shelves are filled with the first edition base set packs for $3. Yeah, that's the crazy part. Everyone brings their cars to school and trade, show off their friends. Parents begin to worry about the violent nature of Pokemon. Many schools banned the trading cards, but we didn't care. Yeah, they banned them at my school, too. We snuck them in any way we could. As time would roll on, we were introduced to the first movie in, in November 1999. I remember that one. Um, our love of Pokemon collecting would continue to grow as we battled in Pokemon Stadium. That was an amazing game. And took pictures on Pokemon Snap, another amazing game, on our Nintendo 64 we got for Christmas. I did get it for Christmas, too. We were introduced to the Johto, you're reading my mind, the Johto region 1999 with the introduction of Pokemon Gold and Silver. What a great time to be a kid. Now, it's 2002, Pokemon has just combined TC with po Game Boy games. With the introduction of the e-reader cards in Pokemon Expedition, I present to you Pokemon Release 2002. And there's going to be a big one. All right, I have to dig through here to get to the first one. Oh, there it is. All right, this is open first. Oh, my God. So we are there. We are at the original era right now. The time capsule. What is all this? Oh my god! It's a Dragonite! Okay, wait, wait. What? What is this? Is this part of. Wait. Hold on. Oh my god. Wait, we got Charizard. We got Pikachu. Wait, this looks very familiar. Oh my god. Wait, 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 this is about to get crazy. Yo, check it out. I got it together. So these are Pokemon V trainers. I actually never had this as a kid, but um, I have it as an adult. So that works just as well. But you can battle gym leaders in here. I think you can battle other players too with these things. But yeah, they they come off. Like all the parts come off. You can change the Pokemon and everything. This is sick. Um, dude, I love like the just the, the random like things that you can get in this mystery box. That's, that's like my favorite part about it, honestly. All right, moving on to our second item. And there's plenty left in there. That was just the beginning of this thing. Let's see what we got in this one. Okay. Normal envelope. Um, oh, we got a note. Okay. Oh, oh, wait. Is that? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. All right. I know it's not until next summer, but Violet's birth first birthday party wouldn't be complete without a 90s invitation. Yo, let's go. Oh, my God. Dude, I think I actually had these. I think I actually had these for one of my parties as a kid. Design wear, eight invitations. Oh, what? That's crazy. Okay, open third. Okay. This could be very cool. This could be very cool. This is old school. This is old school. It's in a frame. No, you did it! Oh my god, it's Pokemon Snap! Yo, it's Pokemon Snap! Wild Pokemon running free on Nintendo 64. Get focused and ride with us as we expose the secrets of the Pokemon Island. The photo safari begins on page 14. Dude. I love this. I don't think we can beat this. I, I, I think this is the best mystery box. Let me know down below in the comment section. I honestly think this is the best mystery box we've ever had. Okay, open fourth. See another envelope. Oh wait, nope, nope, it's a note, it's a note. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I've seen this one before. Uh-oh, oh yeah. Dude, how long did this box take you to put together? Like the artwork alone on the outside of the boxes, I can't imagine, but like actually all the stuff inside of it, God, you weren't kidding. We got a Squirtle. Remoraid, we're going to the Neo. Oh, we're back. We're back in the Wizard of the Coast era right now. We got Neo Destiny. We got base. We got Neo Discovery. We got E-Series stuff. Expedition. Legendary collection. Oh my god, Haunter. Yep, I I, I think I think the statement is true. Shuckle. Oh man. Rocket now. We got Eevee. Ammonite, Voltorb, yo, we are flying. We are flying through all these uh, all these generations of Wizards of the Coast right now. Wingle, we got some more Neo Discovery, Neo Revelation. I saw in there. We got two coffins. Why not have two? Smooch him, Pseudo Wudo. We got Farfetch, Neo Rev. Lots of Neo Rev now. Lantern, Quagsire, Caterpie, Bay. Oh, we got Base Two. Can't forget Base Two. Golbat, more Neo Rev. Fossil, we got Remoraid. We got Clefairy, Ivysaur, Hitmonlee, Skarmory. This is insane. Ooh. First edition. 
Okay, so this is a different language. More first edition. Oh, we got the Bulbasaur. Okay. Okay, Metapod, Vulpix, and a Doduo. Or actually, a, a Dodu. All right, open fifth. I don't know. I think it goes up to like 10 or 11. There's a lot in that box. Okay. Okay, what else? We're just seeing so much variety here. It's insane. I've never seen anything like this before. I've literally never seen anything like this before. <laughs> no, you did it. No, you did it. We got a fossil booster pack in there from 1999, the third ever set release for Pokemon. Okay. Was there anything else? No, that's fine. That's that's plenty. That's plenty. All right, open sixth. Open sixth. What could this be? Is this? Oh my God! It's it's VHSs. Dude, what do we have? What do we have? What do we have? Oh, oh, the Johto journeys. Is this like a single episode? This is crazy how we had to buy, do this back in the day. Um, the Johto Journeys, or Circus Rampage, uh, featuring gold and silver Pokemon. Got Totodile on this thing. Oh my god, Pioneer, Pioneer. Check it out. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's 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 been rewound as well. That's perfect. We can just pop it in the old VHS, get the tube TV warmed up, and we're ready to go. Four Kids Productions, yep, I remember that. All right. Oh, Poke Friends. Poke Friends. Is this when they are lost in the um, on the island? I don't remember. Oh, wait, no. It says it right here. Uh, Ash and his friends discover a spa for wounded Pokemon that is guarded by brave Bulbasaur. Can Ash Bulbasaur protect the spa from your rock? Yep, okay. Ash finds an abandoned Charmander. Both of them have... Bro, this is... Oh, this is, oh my God. It's the best episode ever. It's literally the best episode ever. Look, we got the VHS right there. And wake up Snorlax. Another classic. Oh, oh, oh. And then you have, okay, the evolutions when Mikey wants to get pressured to evolve ZV. Dude, these are some iconic episodes. Is it just one episode or is it a... Oh, no, no. Here we go. It's three episodes. The Battling Eevee Brothers, Wake Up Snorlax, and Showdown at Dark City. And then back to the other one was... Um, and then back to the other one was Bulbasaur in the Hidden Village, Charmander, the Stray Pokemon, and here comes the Squirtle Squad. Oh, dude, the classics. The trio right there. All right, open seven. What is this? What is this? Okay, I think I got it. What is... What is... What the heck? This is crazy. Pocket monsters. List number two. Do you know these monsters? Is this like original? I've never seen this before. This is like super old school. Oh my God, that is sick. Yo, I have so much stuff that I need to hang up. Wow. I don't know. I guess these came in different, like, numbered or whatever. Wow. There's just too much cool stuff. All right, open eighth. I think these are the final three items in here. I just can't imagine the amount of, of, of like, time it took to put this whole thing together and thought and everything. This is crazy. This is crazy. I don't know. Like, I guess this, I don't know if this is just part of your collection, TJ, or like what's going on because you got some, you got some absolutely crazy stuff. Here we go. Open eighth. It feels like a magazine, maybe, or a book. Ooh, Pokemon trading card game player's guide. I've never seen this one. Gamebooks.com, um, Sandwich Islands Publications. Originally, nine, uh, four dollars and ninety-eight cents. Never seen this one before. Oh my God, it's, uh, dude. It's like history. Whoa, okay. So we have all the cards from base, like just all information. I feel like I had to have seen this as a kid at one point, but I definitely never owned this, I don't think. Okay, we got like just so much stuff going on in here. All the old cards, single card rules. Whoa, okay, that's pretty, oh my God, Pokemon Snap, of course. Pokemon Snap's in here. Ooh, old school Japanese. Oh, Pokemania. Well, that's so random. Separated at birth. This is the Pika, a cute little rodent that kind of re resembles a Pikachu. Hmm. Is it based off of that? Maybe it's not. Maybe that's what it's based off. We officially have this now. Ooh, the old theme decks. Old packs, tournaments, uh, slash mall tours. That's an 
California. Maybe one of you, maybe one of you watching right now was in one of these photos. This is the Westminster Mall in California. This is so interesting. Blockbuster Snap. We got the video games red and blue. Got Pokemon Stadium there. We got Pokemon Trading Card Game. What in the world is this? Pokemon Trainer Survival Guide. That is definitely not a Charizard. Well, that was really cool. All right, open ninth. Only two more. I say only, but not really because it's been insane. I just can't believe this. Uh, honestly, I'm, I'm gonna like I'm gonna have to go look through everything again because it's just been insane. I never expected. I did not expect this. I did not. Oh, dude, the original toys, bro. No way. Charizard. Oh my god, the original Tommy toys. From like the vending, or no, I guess these ones wouldn't be from the vending, but yeah, there's different ones. And then Gyarados, he's facing the other way. Turn this way. There he is, there he is. Yo, what year is this? This gotta be like, I don't even know. This thing maybe like 90, 96, I don't know. I have no idea. We're at the final item though, open last. All right, this part makes me nervous. Cause this is the last one in the last box the oldest generation guys this has been a walkthrough a time capsule of pokemon not just the cards though but pokemon in general these are psa cards by the way these are psa cards okay here we go i don't know which way to reveal these maybe maybe i should do it this way maybe i should do it this way okay we got a japanese card oh lugia from neo genesis Okay, okay. An EX6, not too bad, not too bad. All right, Lugia. Ooh, Rockets Moltres, first at Gym Heroes. Near mid seven, first edition hollow. Okay, next card. Oh, Entei Black Star promo from Pokemon 3, the movie. PSA 9, I love this one. Nice swirl. Three more, three more. Maybe I was supposed to do this for all the other PSA cards. Like, do it this way. I don't know. Dark Slow, bro. It's a not how, but it is first edition Rocket. And it's a Gem Mid 10. There we go. I don't want this video to end. Venusaur Base Set. Oh, it's Italian. It's Italian. And it's a Near Mid 8. All right, here we go. The last card, the last item in this insane time capsule of Pokemon history is an Umbreon Hollow from Neo Discovery. Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie, that's definitely gonna be my favorite from Neo Discovery. And it's a mid nine. Wow, that thing looks clean, dude. Insane. And there you have it. That was a walk through Pokemon history, starting with the current generation all the way back to the oldest. And that honestly was the best mystery box openings we've ever had on the channel. Huge shout out to TJ and his wife for making this possible. I mean, I'm just blown away by everything. But thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to smash the like button on your way out. Also, feel free to click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day. And I will see you on the next one.